What are you giving up? What are you holding on to? And what are you reaching for this year? I want you to reach what opportunities are in front of you. You know, I want you to think about Kingdom Builders for me is a huge reach. It's what our, it's, I'm doing this so by faith, and I, I think it's interesting that God has called us to, to get involved in missions like this and to support projects and even start tithing from the church. It's like, wow, God, you're really stretching my faith, but I will reach for what you want me to reach for. And I want you to reach for some things. These are some questions that I want you to sit down and think about these questions. What am I letting go of this year? What am I going to hold on to? And what am I reaching for? Let the Holy Spirit give you the steps as you are close to Him, as you spend time with God and, and get to know Him. Let go. Hold on to Him and let Him lead you to reach for some new and you watch what God will do in your life. Amen. Come on, let's give Him a hand today. Praise God. <laughs> Father, thank You today. I'm excited about 2021. 2020 was a, just one of those years. Difficult year. I had a really hard time even seeing next week. But we're through that year, Father, and I believe that through 2020, you're teaching us to hold on to Jesus. We're grabbing on to you with all of our heart, with all of our mind, with all of our strength. Lord, I ask you to lead us step by step through the power of your Spirit. Lord, as we look through these questions, what am I letting go of? What am I holding on to? And what am I reaching for? Lord, will you show us? Will you show us what to do? We are weak within ourselves, but we have, been, we have learned to rely completely on you. Father, thank you that you did not abandon us, but you gave us your spirit to guide us step by step. Help us, Lord, to not give in to our flesh. Teach us, Lord, how to die to ourselves and to live for you, to walk with you carefully. Small steps, small improvements. But Father, we just trust you with our lives. We know the world is moving away from you. But Lord, we will hold on. We are immovable. And we thank you for it, Lord. I just pray right now, your spirit to touch every person's heart right now. Let your presence fill every life. If you're here today and you've never received Christ, I want you to just receive him right where you're sitting, just, just say, Jesus, I welcome you into my life. Be the Lord of my life. Just say, Jesus, come into my heart. I give up control. Thank you for filling me with your spirit. In Jesus' name. Everyone said, Amen. Amen.